When this baby hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. Hey YouTube, this is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists who have low subscribers and low views as well as talented artists from around the world. Now once again, I have no idea or the reason why they have low subscribers or low views but I'm going to bring it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now today I'm going to do my best to upload about 5 reactions this is going to be my last one. I am, or oh, um, there might be a room for a little bit more. This one is uh, Miyagi without Andy Panda. Um, so this particular track is called Trench Town, and I don't need to uh, to let you know why I'm going to do it, but I'm going to let you know why I'm going to do it because it's a homage to Bob Marley, and I think, wow. Come on, I've got to do it. If once you hear anything to do with Bob Marley, you have to react to it. He is a homage. And being that my family background is Jamaican, um, and you know, my mum and my, 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 my both my parents are from Jamaica, it's like, right, okay, let's see what Miyagi's got. Let me see. And I know he's going to do it justice. So I'm really, really excited to react to that. Um, but before that, if this is your first time coming over to my channel, then please go over to my homepage and work your way from the bottom all the way up to the top because there are some fantastic amazing artists which I do not want you to miss out on and if you go into in my home um, the, the home page it's broken out into various categories so the top bit is um, hip hop is hip hop from around the world and within the hip hop from around the world you have established and non established artists so you've got African hip hop you've got Jamaican hip hop you've got American hip hop you've got English hip hop you've got Romanian hip hop you've got German hip hop um, you've got um, Brazilian hip hop you've got Indian hip hop. I've got it all kind of hip hop is in there. Russian hip hop is all in there. So um, uh, there's international um, European hip hop. There's all there. And the same thing with R&B, same thing with heavy metal, same thing with indie, same thing with country, same thing with ballad, same thing with jazz. It's all in there. So please enjoy yourself. And don't forget to leave me a comment. And if you do leave me a comment, I will read your comments out. Once again, if you want me to give you a shout out or read your comment, all you have to do is leave a comment. It's simple as that. Now, I would love you to follow me on Instagram And when you do, please leave me a voice message That's Uncle Momo's Music Reactions Now, please search me, find me And what you have there, I, I upload about, say, one minute snippet Of majority of my reactions that I've had the pleasure to carry out So the artists have the opportunity to give me a mention on their site So there's loads of interactions between myself and artists So if you want to join in on that, then just join me on Instagram That's Uncle Momo's Music Reactions And don't forget, leave me a voice Messages. I'd like to say a big massive thank you for everybody that has left me a voice message so far and also just jumping in and interacting with myself. Well, I'm going to read a couple of your comments, then go straight into um, Miyagi. Um, I will carry on doing reactions from um, by Miyagi and Andy P and the Panda, Andy Panda. So don't um, don't worry about that. Also. If you don't understand my language and you put on the CC, um, you know, the captions, next to the CC caption icon, there's a setting button. You click on that setting button and go into auto-generated. You have a number of lists of countries that you can translate my CC to subtitles into. Um, I have now sorted that out. So don't forget, you go to um, right next to that icon, that square box icon where you can click on for the CC or not CC to CC or not to CC. That is the question. Um, you know what I'm talking about Go in next to it And there's a settings And you click on the settings And it's auto generated Click on the auto generated And a list of countries That you can translate um, my, um, my, my The subtitles into War pair So um, I'm, I'm happy about that um, I want to say Good morning to um, Enton Pix Good morning to Musa Musa Good morning to Dennis um, 3387 Good morning to Vincent Van Gogh Good morning to Lindemann 88 um, 83 sorry um, Good morning to Joshua Crom um, good morning to Smith Wilson. Good morning to um, I don't know how to pronounce this. Um, Abidel Kahim. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Good morning to Anik. 
Good morning to Little Boy. Um, good morning to Alex Week. Good morning to Jordan TM. Um, um, you know what? I just, I just had, and I've just seen. This is absolutely amazing. Five days ago, five days ago, um, uh, Miyagi and Andy Panda um, from um, Jamin Records sent me a message, <laughs> and I should have put this on. So I will put this on as well. Uh, so go into it. Um, they saw the um, the Brooklyn reaction, and and it says. Um, um, Miyagi and Dependo Amigo, goddamn, that's what he's put down. And and said, I will do all of the songs, and I've, and I've put fist punch star star. So I have got a reply back from Miyagi and Andy Panda. Please go into my com um. If you go into the Miyagi and Andy Panda reaction of Brooklyn, you will see it right there. Um, it's between Jordan T M and Smith Wilson. So I want to say a big massive thank you for your support, and I will continue to do your amazing tracks. God, they are brilliant. Anyway, I'm sorry, I'm going over the four minute mark, way over the four minute mark. Um, apologies. So without further ado this is Miyagi with Trenchtown homage to Bob Marley you know what we're here for great vocabs and a damn good video audio music can you dig it no woman no cry can it can it be copied quite successfully outside of Jamaica? Well, if you see where I feel for the music, it can be copied, you know. But it's not copied. Yet. It's the feel. Wicked. You know? It can Brilliant intro already. Where if you had splinter musician, them know it, but them can't do it. My calculations are correct. When this baby hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. Can't be finished.
So that was Miyagi with Trench Town with the memory of the great Bob Marley. He has done it so much justice. I love the concept that you've got Bob Marley in the Leighton Orient um, going into, you know, going back to the future. And then you've got the certain titles of, um, of the particular tracks that I, I, I only presume that have a, a, a close emotional tie to Miyagi. Um, that's that's in there. I love that he's on a skateboard. He's got the boom box and he puts in the uh, the trench town um, tape in there. And then you got the picture of like Bob Marley. You see when he's putting the rearview mirror, he's got a picture of Bob Marley in that animated um, feeling. Hats off to the person who's done the video. Hats off. That was as incredible. Who would have thought of that kind of um, that format to do it in? And this it's just absolute brilliance. I just love the way how you thought out the box. Anybody that was doing that does a tribute to Bob Marley. Um, it's either live performances or it's a video. And it's def there's certain different kind of homage. But I've never seen a sort of like a a cartoon animate um, animated or anime as you call it um rep representing any of bob marley's songs so that is an absolute gem it really is i've got to share this with my friends i really have this is absolutely brilliant i love the concept about the whole thing imagine that bob marley who would have think of that imagine if bob marley was here in a latent duo in a durian going back into time to see or, or going or just be present to see the amazing impact that his music has had and how it's still transcending and how it's still influencing people long after his um long after his death and as you know that you know Bob Marley died of um cancer um i believe he died in sweden then taken back uh, then taken back over to um to jamaica um it was in if you see a do documentary um Bob Marley went to sweden and that's where they cut off his locks um to go through the treatment and all that kind of stuff they collected his hair and all that stuff but yeah his locks was cut off um and i believe i believe it was uh, there is a documentary about that but that's what uh, um, happened so people, a lot of people thought that he died in jamaica no he were, he was in sweden in a, a medical thing and that's where he passed away then they moved his body back over um to jamaica so it just goes to show how the impact of the world that bob marley had around the world and the influences around the world it's just so amazing that miyagi's done this i'm I would have liked to have seen um, um, Andy Panda in there, but I, you know what? I'm still happily, um, very, very happy that I've witnessed and done a reaction to this particular track. The influence that you had and the concept that you had, but also having the diffusion between Bob Marley and the introduction when you had is a bit of a documentary talking about, um, you know, anybody can copy his music. It's not a problem. It's about, it's not about copying. It's about the feeling, you know, and that was a massive potent statement that you put in there. And it was very, very relevant to this time and even to now because even when you listen to Bob Marley's uh, music it still has a message for you a personal message for you that can inspire you that can move you that can energize you and it's just lovely to see that you know so many people around the world still have Bob Marley in their hearts and know what he what he stood what he stood for and to pay homage to him in in a unique way as such as this is just absolutely extraordinary it really is I am so 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 happy that I've witnessed and um, what Miyagi's done to this particular track in all different kind of ways and I love the way how you um, fused it with what you were doing in there it wasn't only just doing a remix of a sound um, of Bob, Bob Marley and it's what your personal feeling and your personal touch um, that and your essence that you put into this video that made it so uh, that made it relevant again you know there's certain times that you know Bob Marley sort of like there's a distance um, Bob Marley's always humming the resonance of Bob, the, the frequency of Bob Marley is always humming around the world and all it takes is a particular title or a particular song um, f that you hear that just makes you that just brings it back up again you know there's only a few legends uh, around the world that can do this you know and I have a Jamaican artist a small island, <laughs> yeah, a small island that had amazing large impact on the world. It just goes to show you that it doesn't matter who you are. 
You know, it doesn't matter when you was born. It's about what impact and what footprint you're going to lay on the planet before you go. And how much it's going to resonate across the whole world. And, 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 and like I said, you keep him alive by remembering him. But you make it more potent when you you know his name, you know his songs, and you can sing his songs, and you have that kind of personal emotional tie um, with um, with a legend such as him. That's why Miyagi's put down the great Bob Marley. Um, absolutely amazing, Miyagi. You've just outdone yourself. You really have outdone yourself in this one. And for that reason, I salute you, sir. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant.